How was your mom a cool mom? You know, thinking back, you know, I it took me a while to realize, okay, my mom had some cool qualities. Because to me, my mom was always kind of like the, uh, oh, mom. And that's, she was mom. And, and like, that's my mom. Yeah. You know, <laughs> that's yep. my mom. You know, uh-huh. that, that kind of, you know, a little bit embarrassing. And it was one of those things where, like, uh, she would cut my hair. In, she wouldn't send me to a barber. She would cut my hair herself in the backyard. And, like, my friends would cut through the yard and they'd see it. And I'd be like, oh. And she'd be like, you're. <laughs> she'd be like, hi, guys. You're next. You're next. And they'd be like, hi. And I'd be like, oh, mom. Oh, that's precious. <laughs> oh, I wish I would have been there. Yeah. So, you know, I mean, look, I, I look back and I'm like, yeah. I mean, she was a cool mom because. You know, she was uh, raising uh, me and my two sisters on her own. She had a full-time job as a, as she was, a, you know, tenured professor there in the school of nursing. And then she also decided she was going to go to law school there in her 40s. Smart lady. And yeah, I know, exactly. And so, like, she just, like, reinvented her career, like, late in life. And I was like, all right, that's pretty cool. So, that is amazing. So, yeah. yeah. So, and she sounds like she's an amazing barber. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, the flow bee, do you remember that? That was like a. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, that was, the attachment were, onto like the vacuum, right? Right. That was around. She didn't use that. She just okay. used. Uh, regular clippers and scissors and stuff like that. But Oh, um, I bet it looked great. <laughs> I bet it looked great. Well, and it was one of those things that I remember one time I was on a bus and uh, the, I, I had like a – I have a calic. I have a natural calic on the back of my head, right? Yeah, so do I. Mm-hmm. And, and it, it kind of like – there's like a little indentation there in the middle of my hairline, right? Uh-huh. And so I remember I was on a bus and someone sitting behind me was like, What's up with your hair? Would your mom cut your hair? Oh, God. And I'm like, <laughs> she did. <laughs> I would have been like, no. <laughs> I know. I was like, oh. <laughs> so I want to know how your mom was the cool mom. Uh, Jen texted in and said, my mom on her 50th birthday got her first tattoo. Oh, wow. It was a pair of lips on her butt cheeks. <gasps> Hey there. Oh, no, no. Hey oh, there. no. Oh, <laughs> no. What are you doing, Mom? Is that so she could be like, you know what? Kiss my butt. I mean, hey, your mom could fall into that category. She could. She did not get lips on her butt, though. <laughs> she didn't. She got a dolphin on her ankle that Dad didn't notice for three months, while my sister got a tramp stamp on the back of her lower back. <laughs> it does. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hang on a second. She what? got the little flower. I know, I know, I know, I know. Wait, wait, wait. What is the meaning of a dolphin tattoo? There's no hidden meaning. Is there... My mom would not, like, do Hang that on. much research or be that deep. She's probably just like, oh, that's really <laughs> I cute. know. Let's put that on my ankle. Kelly, Kelly, I understand that. But I'm I'm, I'm trying to figure out if, if she there's, like, a hidden accident... meaning that she didn't know about? Yeah, oh, exactly. If there's something that she's, like, projecting, like, hey, I'm a swinger. <laughs> like, like a pineapple on the porch? I know, exactly. <laughs> she's like, my neighbors are so friendly. <laughs> it's like, mom, the dolphin tattoo means... Oh, uh, no, it looks like the dolphin tattoo just um, it's means... It's just a dolphin? Uh, it's a symbol of the beach and ocean, appeals to yes. people who identify as free spirits. There you go. Yeah, that's my mom. She's All right. outgoing. All right, free spirits. She was awesome because she was a lunch lady. She worked in our school cafeteria for 18 years. So she, like, knew all the kids. <laughs> She was I, I, that, awesome. that is the cool. mayor of the lunchroom. Uh, Bailey, <laughs> Bailey messaged us. Uh, my mom is such a cool mom because she is always trying to win us tickets on your morning show <laughs> <laughs> and calls you guys our friends. Her friends. Oh, yes. that's great. I love that. We are friends. <laughs> that's great. Love it. Oh, shoot. Mike, uh, my mom is the cool mom. I'm 40 and she still does my taxes. Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, Mike, that's not cool, Mom. You need to just do your own taxes, buddy. <laughs> that's, your, that's your mom enabling at this point. That's <laughs> that, great. That's not cool. That's enabling. That's what He's that's just called. like, look, she wants to do it. <laughs> right. She wants to say it. no. I'm going to say no. I get, 
I'm getting refund after refund. How? Why? Why quit? <laughs> He's such a good boy. He deserves money back. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ali sent us a text of her mom from back in the day. She said, "No explanation needed. Just look oh at her. My. She's still the coolest hippie chick around." She Dang, was Allie, cool. Your mom she was had a, attitude. Your mom was freaking fire. Yeah, she was. Oh, and she, I'm sure she still is. Yeah, she and she's like she's like down to business. Yeah, like, I mean she's she's, like, she's, she's got uh-uh. some sass in Don't that photo. Love me. it. Yep, love it. Yeah, Miranda, my mom still gets me Easter baskets at thirty. <gasps> you know what? That's never gonna end. That's great. no, love that's that. fantastic. Love that. that is awesome. Yeah, uh, Tara sent in. First of all, she let us go to Vegas as little kids. Oh wow! <laughs> and did we do the I, gambling? I like what y'all. F- our, our blanketing and umbrelling cool mom as, right? Uh-huh. It reminds me of this. There are no rules in this house. I'm not like a regular mom. I'm a cool mom. <laughs> right, Regina? Please stop talking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> From Mean Girls there, for those of you who haven't seen that classic movie, Kelly. Uh, I, you know what? Um, update. I did watch it. Did you really? Literally two nights ago. Oh, well, congratulations. I can't yeah. make fun of you about that anymore. Well, <laughs> I was sitting there. I regretted it instantly uh-huh. with the language. And oh. I'm sitting there with my daughter. Oh, well. There's much of it. Yeah, yeah. There's I much mean, of it. It's an like, ad- you didn't warn me about how much of it. It's a rated R movie, Kelly. No, it's not. Yeah, it was it PG-13. Oh, was it PG-13? Yes. Oh, all right. And so I thought it was fine. It was not really fine. <laughs> it wasn't really fine. I kind of have immediate regrets. Oh, it's all good. <laughs> uh, Emily said, my mom used to bake chocolate chip cookies every Saturday, and all the neighborhood kids would come over and play, and she'd send them all home with baggies of cookies. Man, that was a cool mom. Oh, right that is awesome. All right. All right, well, cool. Well, hey, you know what? However cool your mom was, you know, make sure you celebrate her.